emotional trauma is not something you want to play with because i've been in the same shoes of being like having emotional display and stuff like that and let me just tell you the truth it's something i don't want you guys to go through because it's a very very bad experience you begin to think about yourself as a bad person and why did you even go into the relationship and so many things will just go through your head so in this video i'm going to be telling you how to get over emotional trauma my name is paul i'm into dating tips my lifestyle talks and just to make you guys a better version of yourself stick to the end of this video and make sure you subscribe and like this video have you been in the situation that they they served you the best food that you love eating and you don't just have the appetite to eat just because you are thinking of this particular lady that broke up with you or that did not even accept you as a boyfriend or this particular girl that did not accept you to i don't know or the, the guy that just broke up with you or is playing is using you as a as an alternative or something like that you just like you are going crazy in your mind emotionally like it's disturbing you you can't think straight you don't have anything to do you are just like you're just a empty empty barrel because of that other person all your mind is focused on how to get acknowledgement from that other partner that is emotional stress like emotional trauma and you are being injected into that emotion and it's affecting you badly your physical body like you don't even have time to take care of yourself all your mind is not even fixed on taking care of yourself or even doing other things to make yourself better all your mind is fixated on getting acknowledgement from that partner or trying to know why that partner did whatever he did or even just to know the reason that is what your mind will be thinking of like why did he do this to me like why am i not accepted to be the boyfriend or why am i why am i not accepted to be the girlfriend am i beautiful enough am i not I like handsome enough am i like those are the kind of questions that will be running through your head and even your friends you won't have time for friends like people will call you to come out and say guy please let's let's hang out you like I'm, I'm busy you are not busy you are thinking about that particular partner and it's getting your emotions down daily daily and there's no matter of music or fame you listen to so far you are still putting your mind into that case of that partner you have or has not even accepted you or broke up with you then you are no way to getting over your emotional trauma but i want you to take these steps that i'm going to give you very very serious and i bet you that you will get over your emotional trauma the first thing is stop thinking with your heart but think with your head like think with your skull your brain because if you're thinking with your heart you're actually following your feelings the art is all about the emotions like the feelings you have for that person or for that other partner of yours and definitely if you are using your art to think it's going to tell you go back to that person or go and beg that person or go and find out why that person did this to you or keep on messaging that particular person like why didn't you do this why did you do that why don't you accept me or even trying to be the nice guy like you are taking yourself away from that bad guy sexy attitude you have and you are becoming the nice guy entering into the friend zone and if you have entered into the friend zone that is that's another case for you to just try and come out like lift yourself away from it so we are talking about the emotional trauma so you have to stop thinking with your heart do not follow what your heart says your heart your heart definitely tell you to go back to that partner talk to that partner or try to be nice to okay maybe in being nice the other partner will actually give you a chance to get closer no that is your heart might need you to think with your brain like think with your brain like what are you gaining from this relationship what are you gaining from this stress that you are going through why are you thinking like this i want you to look at the current stage you are now and think backwards about the former stage you were before how you normally take care of yourself like how do i look like and look at yourself now think with your head like what are you doing wrong like your head will definitely tell you that you are doing something very wrong so i want you to use your head to think like using your brain to think rather than using your art 
because they will say follow what your ad says no if you follow what your ad says at this particular time that you are in emotional problem and disorder you are definitely going to go back to that emotions because your art is clouded and full of emotions about that other partner or any other thing that you are thinking of so think with your brain and not with your art that is the first thing i'm going to tell you today the second thing is to acknowledge your emotions like give yourself time to process the story don't stress yourself and accept that yes you have made mistake and there is nothing you can do about it like you just you just accept what is going on that particular time that yes i fucked up yes i really fucked up and it's my fault i don't need you to blame yourself really like don't give it the real blame that it's your fault because some people's mindsets like if they start blaming themselves then depression comes in like i'm the one that caused all this but just have it a way that it came naturally and definitely it is now your turn to get past that emotions that have occurred to you in one area of your life or something like that so what you have to do now is to accept that it has happened like the emotion and everything it came up the problem the relationship problem it came up and there is nothing you can do to it give yourself time to process it like i know the brain is trying to like did this particular thing happen to me like am i the one it happened to like hey hold me it up yes hey, oh you there's nothing there is no body relationship problem cannot affect be it even guys or we that are giving relationship tips we are not god and we are not the best we are also affected by this kind of relationship problem and emotional trauma in all aspects of life but the difference is that we know how to contain it better than some other guys and that is why i'm giving you this tip and making you guys to be like how i coped in my own situation and stuff i actually gave time for myself like when it happened to me and i was like yes i i, I have so many beautiful ladies in my dm that I did not even talk to and i'm dying because of this particular girl like something is wrong like paul something is wrong somewhere then i started thinking like no 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 i have to cut ties with whatever is happening in my life right now that i have to just think straight like my i'm not getting my head well because i was having this particular headache at some point so i started thinking that yes i i needed time away from this girl for over like a week i did not speak to her and funniest thing is that she never even remembered to text me or to even remember that someone is dead i always speak to her every fucking day so i began to see clearly that no 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 this girl doesn't even know that i existed so why am i killing myself and it was the moment i gave myself time and accepted that yes this emotion is there and it has happened then my head started to think straight and i began to know the right thing to do to overcome this emotional problem so learn to accept the emotions and you are already like getting closer to overcoming any emotional problem that you have make a commitment to forgive the person and make space between you and the person that will be the third tip that i want to give you guys today i get it you want to get over the person like the person have done you so much emotional problem but if you are still having grudges for that person i bet you there is nothing there is no therapist that you want to employ that can help you so the first thing you have to do is to forgive like after you have accepted that yes this bad scenario has happened and there is nothing you can do about it so just forgive the person and just think of it like hmm, what if i was the one that offended someone actually the person will forgive me because i'm not i'm not the best and the other person the other partner is also not the best so just forgive the person and give space 
delete every pictures you have of that person or any connection any tie that is tying you down on social media face to face if you are living close find a way for me i was living somehow a little bit close to her so anytime i want to come out i'm really looking at my streets like is, is she coming out like i don't even want to see her face to face that is how terrible mine was i like i don't even want to see her face to face because i was i was very bad then like unkept even my friends were looking at me like paul what's going on with you like are you not eating like well something is wrong with you you are not yourself like the normal paul i'm very jovial and you know stuff like that but i became someone that was inside my own shell like i was caged so i needed to forgive uh and also forgive myself like i did wrong by actually loving her too much than she even even thought that i was even alive like god created me something like that so i forgive that and move on with my emotions and deleted any contact or tie that i have with her just like to start a new beginning that is the thing i want you guys to do start a new beginning like have it in your head that that is the past there's this cartoon that said uh, get your past behind you i don't know i don't know i don't know but just have it in the past that it's something forgotten and you have to start a new life for yourself that is something you have to put in your head 247 if you want to overcome any emotional problem or trauma it's just like put it in the past and you are just a new person so after you have done all those you have forgiven you have cut ties with the person and you have accepted that the emotion has happened and now you are thinking with your head you are thinking with this tiny brain of ours like ours so what i want you to do now is to move out with friends do something that is going to take your mind away from thinking and going back to that problem of yours like move out with friends if you have friends that you you uh, you hang out with that this is the best time to call them over like go out have fun enjoy yourself eat the kind of food like you want it's been long that you have eaten something to your mouth and you actually tasted it like wow this is nice this is the food i want to like keep on eating so this is the best time for you to just go out enjoy yourself watch movies do whatever thing that you like to make yourself happy like just change come on have friends like one or two friends that you know you really trust and just speak out like speak out to the person don't just put this problem inside your mind like yes there's this there's this thing that i have if i'm angry with someone and i don't tell that person my mind there's this like every burden in my mind that i don't like so it's until i tell someone that see this particular person did this to me and i don't really like it then i will become free like this burden is not just in my mind it's also in another person's mind so that is what i want you to have like a friend of yours that you really trust with your words and secrets and you can just expose everything to that person like pour out your mind to that person the person will actually be there to like yes mm. see just girl just forget about this guy or guy let's just have fun forget about this girl that is what they will probably tell you and they are very correct at this particular moment you have to just forget about that person and move on with your life invest in yourself have fun go swimming party clubbing anything that you have to do to just take away your mind from that particular thing that happens to you don't smoke i'm not telling you to go into smoking or taking drugs because th that is just temporary thing to forget like it, it will still come back so you have to just work on yourself focus more on yourself of invest in yourself more and just be a better version of yourself so the next tip is to ask yourself whatever you have learned from your past and take things slowly in your next relationship or your next step in life like now finally you have started thinking with your head and you have accepted that the emotions are there and you have accepted and forgive that person trying to invest in yourself and becoming a better person like a better version cutting ties with that partner of yours that caused the emotional problem for you now what you have to do is just to 
give yourself time in other relationship that you just want to go into or next stage of your life like take it easy there's nobody that is rushing you by taking it slowly you will have the time to ask yourself like what have you learned in the former relationship of yours like what did you learn in that emotional problem that you had what was your mistake what do you overdo at some point that made it to fall into this situation that you found yourself like you have to start thinking about it because if you cannot find something that you learn then you will keep on making that same mistake and whatever relationship you go into in the future terms you will still fall into that emotional problem so if you don't want it to happen again fine you have gotten almost the three tips of trying to overcome your emotional and by now if you are on the third and into this fault right now you are just like a perfect person new individual entirely and you want to know what you have learned from your past so just try settle down and think like what do i learn from this past relationship that happened to me and what was the bad thing that i did and what in this new relationship that is coming what am i not going to do like try and get it to your head that yes i did there are some things that i overdo like i i overdo it anytime i'm in a relationship or i tend to fall in love with guys or girls that does this particular thing and i accept their beauty too much i'm just giving you examples like you need to know the little fault and something you have learned and in your next relationship i'm very sure you are not going to make that same mistakes again if you have acknowledged and outlined those mistakes at this early stage now so that is what i want you to do and i'm very sure if you did all the four tips or followed all the four tips that i just gave you you are very well ready to overcome any emotional trauma or relationship trauma that you have in your life thank you for watching this video make sure you like this video subscribe to this channel and click on the notification bell close to this to the subscribe button so that you could be receiving notification about any time i release a video like this thank you so much my name is paul